Welcome back to Kenton and Habiba. This is going to be a very special busy week crammed into one long vlog because it's Kenton and Kareem's graduation week. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, mom. And then you're in the stomach surgery. Okay, I'm your doctor and I'm studying uh, not your medicine. No, it's true. I eat too much sugar. And I keep the recipe to do you labor cleaner, okay? Dandelion. You know dandelion? Dandelion? Yeah, I do it. I keep you and tell. I yeah. keep you. I keep your recipe. Okay. Okay, you have to go. You can always do it Time. True, true, Dandelion, true, true. Yeah. Um, green apple. Yeah. Cilantro. Yeah, look at you looking like a cowgirl. You look like a California cowgirl. <laughs> I'm a cowgirl now. <laughs> you know what, if you say it's bitter, that means it's really bitter. Is it? Is it bitter like bitter melon? Yeah. Yeah, see, you pause, see? Nah, man. I, I, I don't even. I hate you. No, man. How much you try to feed me bitter melon when I was a kid? I can't stand that taste. You tell me it tastes like that. Benton, I'm not saying it. All right. <laughs> you taste really good. You cook. That's a recipe for medication. Okay. Dandelion, one third cup. Okay. Kale. Kale. Okay. Cilantro. You like cilantro? Very good. Cilantro. Cut all the made or stuff under you. You. Uh, you put that to one third too. Okay. Okay. Ginger, pea of ginger. Okay. Put in here. I keep your recipe because family. I don't keep anybody, okay? <laughs> right. And then, you know, uh, what is it, honey? Uh, Alo? Alo, I get to be that, you know. <laughs> no, no, no. You have to soak it. Alo, I know. <laughs> I told you recipe, I planned really good thing. If you suffer right there, you, you know the recipe. Okay, you don't want recipe. <laughs> it's like the slimy... No, no, she had to cut and she slope and water, okay? But to us, you know, we get and used now. to it already, it's okay, but yeah. And then two green apple, listen, you don't know what I'm feeling. Okay, I'm waiting for the... Two green, green apple, put in here, green. so... Green, that's, that's <laughs> the... That, that's so the they give you a little sweet. 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 Sour. They're sour. No, 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 yeah. no. They are very delicious. Sour. Yeah, yeah not, the, not the delicious. No, not the, the green the, one. <laughs> right. So they put not in the yellow here. one, the green. You yeah. put in it seven different kinds of Okay. Seven different kinds of bitterness. Okay. Kale. Yeah. Dairyland. Yeah. Aloe. Ginger. Cilantro. Cilantro. Two green apples. Two green two apples. Two okay. Mm. So you blend in here. Okay. And they taste really delicious. They look sweet. They're not too sweet, but they, they blend in. So you say you feel so but the delicious. Recipe, so, I feel, uh, so how often do you drink this? Every you day. can drink yeah. that every day. So you got aloe every day? You put, no, That's you, why you put all that. Oh, you, you get aloe all plant. This is called me John. It's <laughs> <laughs> oh, <Lord. laughs> <laughs> Mommy told you, you have to do that because you say you stress, you eat lots of young food. Yeah. Hold that. You, you look down, let me just eat. Relax. Yeah. Relax. Cut off your glass. This is, this is why. She's giving you a massage, Ken. Jenner. Cut the stress. Transition. <laughs> Actually, we put more stress. <laughs> 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 Do you guys want me to drive you around? Take a look. See, he's trying to distract you. <laughs> the sun goes he's down. trying to distract yeah. you. Yeah, yeah. 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 let me take your arms. Okay, let's go home. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here with mom. New age, but it's not, this is what you call more mature. And across Wait, the mom. street there, they, they finished building that <laughs> two years ago. No, she's like 20 minutes from here. She's not that close. Here's the old church here. Yeah. That's the, believe that's the state house of the public. A lot of churches. Some buildings you don't know, they're churches. Tuesday evening, we're picking up my mother. To see you too. How are you doing? You look so beautiful today. Yeah. Here's a coat. Uh, if you need a coat, if you want. Made no, a no, black no, one? Okay, light, yeah. Good, no, good. Okay. Well, we leave it in the okay. car for yeah. later. Yeah, yeah, later, later. Okay. Yeah. Think about me. No problem. Yeah. Ooh, fancy. <laughs>
Oh, yeah, you oh see her God, sexy okay. stockings? <laughs> nice. That's where Mariam yeah. gets the nice legs from. <laughs> yeah. Also, you. Look at you. No, I'm just... I heard your daughter say you live here really nice. Well, yeah, you should have come and visit. No, it's... later. I will. I will. Yeah. You dessert, the big big four, yeah. and enjoy every single day. Every single day. I'm busy. We thank God for that, you know. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Have you stopped working? Oh, you're retired. Going to the law school in Durham for a small send-off hosted by the class behind Kenton's graduating class. I can't even see. <laughs> you all be mad on one night. Did you see that movie? No. Yeah, it's fun. Don't be too good and meet different days. Yeah. I'm just kind of so uncomfortable in uh, almost all the states. Oh, wow. Okay. So, yeah. yeah. Mostly like 30 and up. What you got on there, mommy? Because I have had three years. Time has changed. Yeah, everything changed. Is that San Diego? Yeah, San Diego. Yeah. Yeah. Besides the bags under my eyes, everything else was going really well. <laughs> I'm just exhausted. But anyway, yeah, really happy to have Kenton's parents here. Yeah. 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 Oh my God. <laughs> I don't know why I'm looking at these cupcakes when I know I can't eat them. But this rice pudding, it was really good. Really nice. Adorable. Oh my goodness. Oh, I know, right? What? Cheese. This is so nice. Like, just keep it. Add some water. Oh. Oh, oh, because it was Tuesday evening and a lot of the evening students are working adults, many of them didn't actually show up. So there was so much leftover food and we were encouraged to take some of the food home. My sexy mother-in-law. <laughs> it looks so good. Kenton explaining that it was still finals week and a lot of the law students were still studying and a lot of the day students still had finals to take before graduation. Anyway, we're gonna drop off his parents back at their hotel and call it a day. So we're back home exhausted. What time is it? It's 10.30 p.m. Dropped off Nana, dropped off Kenton's parents. Um, really tired, super thirsty, so just had a drink. And let's see what Ken has there. What's that? Uh, oh, it's just a class gift from, so it's just a little tradition where the, uh, our previous classmates, mm -hmm. they, they host a little dinner. Okay. So, so one of the classmates made a pen for us. That's nice. So yeah, so. What material is it? Oh, does it look like the outside is made out of wood? Yeah, yeah. Mm, Is that cool. neat? Yeah. So, I think, I think his name's Kyle that made it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's, it's always thoughtful when someone makes something, you know, versus just buying. Right. So, I just want to thank Kyle for it, class of uh, 2024. So, he's the year before us, and he'll graduate next year. I just so, finished okay. cleaning up the kitchen, did the dishes. I might have to put this away. The sink is clean, cleared out, and um, yeah, I'm exhausted. I really am. I mopped the floor. So I'm going to go clear up Mariam's room because tomorrow morning, Mariam's coming in and uh, happy to see her. And, um, you know, even though it's just Mariam, the youngest young girl, 
I still make an effort to clean up because I don't want her to come home and feel like, oh my God, my parents don't have it together. Oh my God, I gotta come clean. Cause I know she'll still come look at the fridge and be like, oh, this needs better organization and needs to be clean and that's fine. Or look at the pantry, it's a mess, that's fine. But I wanna make sure her bedroom at least looks presentable. Cause right now it's got laundry. Ken and I have been using it as the laundry room. Like we do laundry and just throw the clothes on her bed so uh, I need to go clear that up but before I do that in fact before I do that let me show you the busy schedule this week so this is what it's been looking like in terms of programs especially in particular for Kenton um, so today was Tuesday right yeah so that's what we attended Ellie send off at the new student union in Durham um, and then tomorrow, Kenton has a bunch of stuff, but um, I won't need to attend because uh, I plan on braiding my hair. <laughs> so, Mariam will be coming in tomorrow. And then the most important days are Friday and Saturday. So, there's so many events going on simultaneously. So, some things we will be able to attend and other things we won't. Well, we kind of had to make a decision and, you know, Kenton, you know, dedicated father feels that the light should be shined mostly on Kareem. So we're going to go to um, as many events with Kareem's school than Kenton's um, graduation. But of course, we're going to see, you know, both their graduations as much as possible. But there are several events going on. Um, at, on Saturday and on uh, Friday at the same time. So it's impossible to attend both. Um, and that's just how it is. It's two separate schools. One's a graduate school, um, you know, or law school. And for Kareem, that's a university in totally two different locations, but they just happen to have planned things at the same time. So the other day I walk into formal dining room, sorry, and it was dark and then I turn on the light and then I look around and I see all of these <laughs> stuffed animals. Okay, this is a long table. Just look how many stuffed animals are on here. And I am like confused. I'm like, I got questions. Whose stuffed animals are these and who put them here? Well, of course, I know it's Kenton, but for who? This is not for our kids. We don't have that many kids. Our kids don't really want all these stuffed animals. Um, it's not for me. So who is it for? Panda bears. And what are these? Sloths. And just black bears. And rhinoceros. And koala bears, right? It says, eco-friendly plush, George the koala. Cute. Anyway, so when I had a minute, I asked him, so what is this all for? Um, I'm asking, trying to figure out what the stuffed animals are for or who they're for. Yeah. So let me hear, who are they for? They're, for my, they're for my baby mamas. No, they're not. Yes, they do. Come I, on. It's time for a confession, folks. I got 12 baby mamas. Are you sure it's too tight? I uh, know, my belly's too big. Yeah, no, seriously, who's it for? I told you, for my baby mamas. Ken, stop. 30 years. Okay, the truth is out. I'm free. I feel like a weight is lifted off of my shoulder. You're an idiot. You know, you're living a lie. Yeah, you're living 12, a lie. I got you ain't got baby. no baby mamas. Nobody want to deal Nick with you. Nick Cannon got nothing on me, baby. Boo, come on though. Who, who? No, they're just for my uh, classmates. Uh, okay. Okay. Or stay in the bar. Stress, you know. Oh, okay. You know, stress relief. All right. His classmates, his classmates. And um, his plan was to tie a cup around their necks. That's what he says, that he wants to put a cup around their necks. Now, I know tomorrow he starts off early to pick up Miriam. He's not going to have time because he says he's going to drop this off with his classmates tomorrow. So I'll do the favor and, um, you know, tie the cups for him. Plus, it's kind of not his thing. This one less thing he needs to do. Um... And then I'll go upstairs and clear up Mariam's room. See, it kind of makes the bear tip down a little bit, but 
Actually, the sloth sits pretty well with the mug. That is so cute, right? So cute, look at that bow. And this is on quite secure, so it's not gonna come off until it's, you know, removed intentionally. I ran out of ribbon, but luckily, Crafty She has lots of ribbon upstairs. So sometimes I just buy ribbon, <laughs> even when I don't have a reason for it, but it always comes in handy. I think the rhino looks kind of cute too with a little mug. Is it a girl rhino or boy rhino? What do you think? May 3rd, Moody Murriam's home. <laughs> the one and only. Anyway, we got a nice meal. Meatballs, salad, plantain. My handsome son is home. Everyone's home. Look here, Khalid, stop being so shy. <laughs> Oh, you look good. You look good. You got a haircut. Yeah, I got it a while ago. Uh, yeah. What? 149. I don't know how I feel about that. You don't think that's too little? I like the suitcase. I need a new suitcase myself. It was bigger than I haven't weighed this much. Oh. In two I thought. Years. Yeah, I thought you had been talking about your complexion. Actually, since COVID, probably since I came out of college and stayed at the house. Mm. So that personal trainer thing's been working out, huh? Well, it's done now. Oh, now you're just working out on your own? Mm hmm That's cool. So here's try this one. So this is a navy blue. You should always have a navy blue, mm -hmm. and your mom suggested it. Turn around. Yeah, a little narrow ass behind. Is there sideways? <laughs> Just checking in. I don't know where to look. I'm on my cell phone. But uh, tomorrow is Kenton's graduation and Kareem's graduation. Tomorrow's Friday, the first day of festivities. Um, Friday, and then we have Saturday. So I'm doing my hair, as you can see. Yeah. So what's the energy like? I'm just kind of trying to update future me and also you. So, you know, a lot of you think like, oh, I'm just making these videos because I'm so damn vain and I just want to share my life because it's so great. <laughs> well, it is great and I'm thankful. But no, honestly, it's almost like a, a video diary. So I like to know that I have this record of my life should I choose to go back in the future or God forbid something happens to me or one of us, you know, the children have something to look back at. But anyway... So morbid, so morbid, Habiba. Uh, but anyway, the energy today, um, been doing my hair, Mariam's home, um, Khalid's home. He's pretty happy, chipper. You know, he's on a high from getting into medical school and now finally making his choice. So you'll be surprised where he's going. Um, yeah, we haven't actually said, we, we showed you in the past our trip to Charleston, but we haven't actually said, you know, whether or not, you know, that's where he's going or not. He may be, he may be not. You'll see in the future. Um, but anyway, Kenton is kind of nervous. I can tell he's very kind of anxious. So when he's nervous and anxious, he tends to curse quite a bit and he's easily irritated because, um, you know, they had a lot of functions at school. He had to go for rehearsal. He had to like try on his gown, uh, make sure his suit is ironed. The, the boys, well, I say the boys, Khalid also needs to uh, steam his suit and make sure he has um, stuff also ready for Kareem because Kareem is still in school uh, because, uh, because he's an RA, he wasn't able to just leave. He has to wait until all the other students um, leave campus before he can leave, which is kind of understandable, but inconvenient for him because he's also graduating. So it's a lot. I'm sure he's going to be tired. Uh, Mariam has been very helpful. She's kind of thin. I'm a little surprised. Um, yeah, I feel like all the kids are thin. Um, Khalid has intentionally, you know, lost weight, you know, had a personal trainer, you know, he's got his own money so he can hire a personal trainer <laughs> and had been working out. And so he's lost weight intentionally. Mariam, I think is just, she says she and Kareem, they just don't like the school food. Um, so, and they also are somewhat health conscious, so they just don't eat as much as they used to. And uh, yeah, so I feel like she's kind of thin right now. 
But otherwise, she's good and she's also seems to be a lot more easygoing. If you're a mom with a daughter, you know how that can be. Y'all can sometimes butt heads and they're mouthy. <laughs> but I don't know. I'm a little surprised. Mariam's come back and she's been very easygoing. And I'm like, I haven't changed. I'm the same person. <laughs> So I don't know quite what it is. She actually even cooked and brought me food. Um, she made a smoothie earlier. Um, she's been a little quiet. I was like, are you okay? Is everything fine? I'm waiting for Malfi Mariam. Where are you? Where is she? But I don't know. She says she's fine. Everything's okay. She's not sick. She's fine. So we'll see. Um, she hasn't had a chance to meet, well, she's met her grandmother before, in, you know, a few years ago, but um, she hasn't had a chance to see her. Um, you know, their grandparents on Kenton's side is here. So uh, we took a break, like, you know, because we know there's so much going on and they also are coming to North Carolina or they haven't been to North Carolina in over like I think 10 years. So we wanted them to have an opportunity to, you know, do what they want to do and go sightsee and whatever. So today we did not meet up um, today and yesterday, but day before yesterday we were together. And then tomorrow, Friday and Saturday we'll be together again. So it's going to be a full house. Oh, and Bashir, my brother Bashir is also here. He has arrived. He's at my mother's house. Um, so anyway, You'll see everybody tomorrow. And I don't know how, look at me doing all this talking when I got stuff to do. Um, yeah, tomorrow you'll see everyone. And I don't know how I'm going to do this vlog. I'm sure it's going to be in parts. Maybe you just see the few days before graduation. And then by the time you see this, I don't know. Anyway, it is what it is. We'll get it together, right? So, uh, bye. Let me finish my hair. Let me finish my hair. It was that day. And traffic would just start. going to the same place. We had a pretty early start. Several hours later, we are finally here at East Carolina University for Kareem's outdoor graduation. Let the festivities begin. Look at all the students. Look at all the families. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Nana. Hi. <laughs> you guys look good today. Uncle Bashir, Nana, you want some water or juice? Grab it now. Give me some water. I was very good and put my hair in my hair. Such a pretty day. It turned out. I was so worried it was going to be cold. Um, you know, then I tell you how that you hate me for it. Yeah, no, now it feels warm. Oh, because I was thinking maybe I should have brought a jacket, but it's not so bad. No, yeah, it turned out okay. It turned out okay. That light jacket, you know. No light hình ra chụp á. Okay, you okay, honey? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I talk. My hands are cold because I got the water. I talk with you, the love one. I don't talk with you, the mean. You understand what I'm saying? But you love your children. You want to be whole. I can, I can have two lanes now. Oh, they wow. so cute. I love them. <laughs> they remind me when I my country, you know? Oh, yeah. In the high school, go yeah. call it. I didn't I come back and here I go call it. I want to be low too. <laughs> I want to uh, help poor people. We can afford to buy, uh, you know, look at Kenton now. Thank God for comfortable shoes because I was going to be cute and have high heels, but no, I'm wearing comfortable wedges. And even though none of our mothers want to hear it, I'm insisting everybody drinks <laughs> frequently. 
Yeah. Please puss. Please puss. Khalid, you're not the favorite son. <laughs> now we're trying to find our way into the stadium because where the graduates go in is separate from where the families go in. <laughs> So many different students graduating. College of Nursing, Fine Arts, Social Work, Journalism, Philosophy, Science, Medicine, Library Science, Education, Dentistry, Home Economics, Pharmacy, Engineering, Music, Law, Physical Education, Public Health, Theology, Physical Therapy, Commerce, Business, Accountancy, Arts, Letters, Humanities. You can get a degree in any one of these different subjects. <laughs> She's silly. <laughs> I'm like vlogging and taking picture. Yeah. <laughs> Three cheese. <laughs> Try to get Kareem stuff. Yeah, see? Now we have to drive back an hour and a half so that we can make Kenton's program. It's a lot of go, 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 go. And we have to eat. That lane that you were in, I saw that lane. Show her around quickly. Yeah, show her. I'm hungry. Yeah. I thought we should eat, just eat out of the containers. Fine, whatever. Really good. Where you get that? From New York. Oh, you go to New York and get it? For sure. For sure. For sure. It came from New York and he bought it. Oh, I'm warming for up. Do they eat shrimp? Said, yeah, she eats shrimp. Yeah. So yeah, she's gonna make this into another room, like a sunroom. She's gonna build here. 
Yeah. Yeah, me too. That's what I say. I like the kitchen. Oh, and then, mm -hmm. and kitten, come show. Stopping to eat at my mother's was probably not the best thing we could have done, but then on the other hand, everyone needed to eat. That, along with the traffic, oh my goodness, we were running late. Kenton was behind, he was getting calls from the school, and he was so anxious, so upset, but we somehow made it. We made it. <laughs> This is the law hooding ceremony and uh, we are all excited to be here and now the nerves have kind of settled. Kenton is in the group. He is down there um, and again you can see the faculty and right next to the faculty on either side are the day students. So the day students typically are the ones that are going to school full time typically right out of university, you know, they tend to be younger. And then the evening students are the non-traditional students who have other careers or are working full time, may be a parent, may have children, and um, they go to law school in the evening and it usually takes them four years. So the evening students go for law school for four years and then the day students typically three years. The class of 2023 has produced some of the top litigators. We are the first class of law students earning a law and tech certificate. And we even have the youngest person to receive their jury doctorate, jurist doctorate from North Carolina Central School of Law, is Rita Reeves. <laughs>
repeat after me. I hereby solemnly pledge unbroken allegiance to my alma mater in appreciation for the opportunity for development afforded me as a student at the North Carolina Central University School of Law. in the Alumni Association, wherever I may be. I pledge as a citizen to exemplify the high ideals, thus and why, seeking truth always, rendering positive service to the community, to the state, and nation, and so to live. Welcome to the Alumni civil litigation tonight. So we have a hearing today.
That is a very Nigerian thing. See all the, all the nice chocolate? Yeah, but there, you can tell they're different than anyone else. Water. 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 Thank you. I'll drink when I go. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, you like those? I'll go. I don't want any. Okay. 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 <laughs> it is, that's their traditional soup, it's different than what you imagine. Yeah. I thought of thick, creamy. No, 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 Then you got to scoop back if you're worried. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at my breast just sticking out there. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, <laughs> So embrace that curiosity 
and open those doors. I've heard it said that people come into our lives for a reason, bringing something we must learn, and we are seem a little strange, but once Kareem got his award, I was preoccupied, obsessed with this man and his giant camera and giant lens. Look at that thing. That is a serious lens.
in a minute. Now that the ceremonies are over, we're driving back to Raleigh for dinner. We have reservations at a French restaurant called Croquette. And this is our first time actually going there. But I'm excited because when we came, we saw the menu and we thought, hmm, this is something we might enjoy. They have things like steak, mashed potatoes, and also for me, when it comes to dessert, they have macarons. And basically, they have gluten-free options, so this should be nice. So half of us had arrived early and because we had been driving and sitting for a while, I really felt like I wanted to go out and stretch my legs. So I went out with dad or, you know, Kenton's stepdad and we went out for a walk, kind of looked around, got some fresh air while my mom and um, Kenton's mom sat at the table and chatted. And oh, my dad's not even in the video. <laughs> Brussels sprouts. You want to try some? Your brother Is it gluten free? Yeah. Okay. You know what? Maybe. No seafood, but she can eat fish. Yeah, she can eat fish. The seafood? Yeah. Steak fries. And the steak fries for me too. <laughs> Mine's well done. Cool. Yeah. Chicken. Chicken. Oh, what? Wow. All right. And what's Daddy's? It's a same as Khalid. It's a steak. Uh, uh, you know, oh, burger. let me see. Lift up the croissant. I didn't see steak. It's a burger. I mean. Oh, okay. Seafood. Seafood. It's a crepe. Right. Crepe. Oh, it's yes. a crepe. It's crepe. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's nice. The canal you do when you have your oh. <laughs> And that is how the day ended. Kenton has his law degree and Kareem has his Bachelor's of Fine Arts. His parents will go back to California. Khalid will go back to Maryland. Bashir will go back to New York and we'll get on with our lives. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I know it was a very lengthy one and I didn't want to break it up into too many pieces. <laughs> But anyway, I hope you enjoyed it. It was fun bringing it to you. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up and I look forward to your comments. God bless you. Bye.